Christina, you idiot. You come to our house, you get my wife's name right. All right. So let's talk about this discussion. You read a title. You read what it says. Let's talk about it. So what if Walt Disney is alive in this generation? Which he probably is. He probably have his brain in the, some kind of machine. He's like a walking robot or something, you know. Beeble, 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 you know, all that shit. You never know. We, we never know. But the thing is, what if he actually was really alive? You know? What are you talking about? He is alive. He's a robot. It was brain machine, like, like from SpongeBob. But besides all that, imagine if he was alive and he saw what's going on with Walt, with Disney Incorporation. You imagine how, how he would flip out. He, this dude would have a fucking heart attack and die again. If he was going on Disney. Well, he'd be, he'd be happy that they got Star Wars and Marvel. He'd probably be happy about that. But the thing is, ah, black people, Asian people, what what the hell's going on here? Hey, maybe that's how he'll react, maybe? Was he racist back in the day? He probably was, you know. The 1930s and the 40s were a different time back in the day. You wouldn't think he, he was fucking racist? He could have been. I mean, he, I don't remember him any, any uh, black people in his shit before. Or any uh, Asians in his fucking... Uh... But the thing is, uh, the only type of Asian people they know back then was to Japanese people. I don't think they know any other Asians back in the day. Maybe I'm wrong, but... Back in the day, it was a different time back then. Plus, World War II was going on, and the deal was that was definitely making fun of like World War II stuff, this and that, making fun of the uh, Japan, you know, the whole uh, Pearl Harbor jokes, stuff like that, you know. But Walt Disney, yeah, he's definitely racist. So there's, no, there's no doubt. Like, like I said, imagine he, if he was around 2022. Imagine this guy will have, well, fucking freak the fuck out. Black people, Asians, gay people. <laughs> it would kill him again. If you saw what's going on right now, it, it, it will fucking murder this guy again. Well, not again. He, he actually would murder himself. He, he'll not like what's going on in this generation. He, he, will, he will fucking freak the fuck out. He, he goes psycho. He'll not like what's going on. I swear, I swear to God, he he'll not like it. I mean, he, he'll like that that Disney owns uh, Fox. I don't know if Fox existed back in the 30s and 40s. I don't think so. He probably be like, "What? What's Fox? What the hell is Fox?" Oh, never mind. 1930s it came out. Uh, the Fox Studios. Yeah, he probably he, he probably knows what that is. He probably be happy about that too. So, oh, you guys got Fox now? Wow. I mean, yeah, that's the only thing he he liked about it. They own Fox. He probably liked that. He probably liked they got Star Wars and Marvel. Even though he, Star Wars movies didn't even exist yet, because it just it just came out in like in the seventies, and the comic books just came out in like I don't know sixties when he's like almost dead or something. So I don't think you know anything about Star Wars. Like, what the fuck is Star Wars? I'm not hundred percent sure. I, I, Star Wars just started just coming out, and. It got popular until like the late 60s or something, and the movies start coming out in like the 70s. So he, he had none, he had absolutely nothing, he don't know nothing about Star Wars. But he'd, be, he'd probably be happy because he, he found out it was like a, worth a lot of money. Well, that's the like only thing he'd be happy about. Star Wars, Marvel, they own Fox, he'd probably be happy all about that, but he, he'd get fucking pissed if he saw a, a black guy in his movie. And uh, fucking, uh, like I said, uh, gay people, the alphabet and shit. And uh, yeah, he he he'll, he'll definitely flip out. He he will definitely lose his shit. He will he'll definitely lose it. But what the fuck are you doing to my business? You're destroying everything, everything. And it'd be all over the news and in the uh, in the internet headlines. It says Walt Disney's been removed from Disney Incorporation for being racist and homophobic. It'd be all over the, all over the papers and shit. That will happen, guys. Big goofy face on here too.